Hi there, Libra. This is Astro Girl, and thanks so much for tuning in for your forecast for April 28th through May 4th. The most exciting thing happening this week is that Venus, your ruler, the planet of love, relationships, is moving into Aries over the weekend, your seventh house of one-on-one -on -one relationships. Mars, the planet of energy and passion, is in your sign, but out of phase. However, he moves direct on the 20th. So that's going to be a day when you should be out and about enjoying uh, any flirtations you can find, if you're single especially. And if you're in a relationship, make sure you set aside time for your other half on May 20. Beginning the week, we have a new moon in Taurus, which is going to be quite interesting. Taurus really rules money and how we sort our finances out. And Taurus is ruled by Venus along with you. So you know what it means to say that Venus has a very good way of making you spend money. Even if you don't have the money. Venus likes sparkly things and she likes the best quality in everything. So if you do feel like going on a spending spree, leave your credit cards at home and just take your debit card. So at least you can only spend what you have. Keep your receipts because the new moon in Taurus will be very, very beckoning and welcoming at stores all over the world. Now, right now with Mars out of phase in your sign, and he has been for quite some time, you are probably feeling down on energy and as if everything you do doesn't seem to work out the way you want it to. How about it's working out the way the universe wants it to work out? and that you don't have as much of a say in things as you may want, but in a way that's good because you're following the path that you're meant to be following. Venus moving into Aries is going to mean that there's going to be some heat happening, that you'll go from a simmer to a fast boil, and that for your relationships with other people, there could be some friction. Aries love to argue and you love to find the peace and harmony in everything. That's why you're opposite signs. You may be called upon more than once over the next couple of weeks to settle a dispute, and luckily it's something you enjoy and that you're good at doing. Thanks so much for tuning in. I look forward to speaking to you again next week, Libra.